We're missing a few players, but I think um, if we can't beat Moldova, then you know we shouldn't be in the competition anyway. Uh, I think we'll win that one and, and probably win it easy, um, even with the players missing. So I'm, I'm hoping that's the three points put to bed, and then we can move on to the next one, which is going to be um, the Wales game, which is going to be a hell of a lot tougher. Roy Keane yesterday kind of was quick to downplay the, the significance of the loss of Gareth Bale for Wales on Monday. I don't think we can really downplay it. Like it's a huge blow for them and a huge boost for us, I suppose. Um, yeah, if, it's, if, if, if everything they're saying is true, you know, I've, I've, I've had that before, where they, some their star player isn't playing for a while, and then suddenly he's, it, things are getting a little better for him when when it's coming closer to game time. But uh, as far as I'm concerned, um, you know, I, I genuinely believe until the night you're not going to know who's going to be playing on either side, and until you do, you're not going to know the the outcome of the game. Is there, do you feel this genuine belief in the squad that we can go to Cardiff and get the result that we need? Of course, yeah, because I, 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 you know, I don't think uh, any Irish player plays a game that, um, or walks onto a football pitch where he believes that he's going to get beaten by the opposition. It happens, but no Ar Irish player wears that jersey and walks out there thinking they're going to get beaten. Can you kind of recall a similar situation when, in your own playing days with Ireland that you kind of went into a game where it's so make or break after a long campaign? Um, you know, there's been lots of times when when I've walked, you know, even against England and Stuttgart, I thought they 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 had a better team than us. But once, like I say, you once you put on that green jersey, you walk out there, and, and um, that day it just happened to be a day that we beat England. So I mean, you know, it happens. What do you kind of feel the Martin O'Neill's message will be in the dressing room? Presuming we do beat Moldova on Friday night, going into Monday. Um, just. You know that, that, that we have. You know we have to lift the game again. But you know Moldova, I don't think are are, uh, are going to give us the same test that Wales are, and I think uh, the players know that themselves. So that I, I hope they're going to go into the Moldova game, taking the three points comfortably, and then go into the Welsh game, giving it their all. And I mean that's all they can do. And if we come home with three points on that on that uh, night, then that that'll be a um, that'll be a great result for us.